Do you remember a while ago I put a video up about converting uh, numbers from the European format, the French format, etc., where you had dots in lieu of commas and commas in lieu of dots? Uh, it looks sort of like this on the screen, if you can see here. So this will be like 12 million, 212,332 pounds, 28. Well, the dots and the commas are in the wrong place. And I did a, a function to be able to sort that out. Well, somebody put a comment on there, and rightly so. So hands up for that big mistake that I made. Uh, it was uh, using, it said it was like a long and a manual way, and absolutely right. There's a much quicker way of doing that. Uh, this is, I think, the third way I've shown of doing this. This one is using the number value function. So let's have a look, the number value function. So if I click basically in cell just B, just here, uh, what I'm just going to do here is I'm going to type in equals and then number value. There's number value there. Just going to press tab on the keyboard to move across. Use the mouse and I'm going to click in the cell that I want to convert basically from text because Excel can't recognize that number as a number, it's just text. Then I type in a comma and then in quotation marks I type in my decimal separator that I'm using here. So I'm now going to close that off. I'm going to press enter and you can see that the number has been converted. Now, I've taken the liberty at the top there, you can see that it's accounting. If I change that to general, just at the top here, if you look here, you can see the number just looks all as a normal number with a decimal here. Let me just change that back to accounting here. That's good. All right, then. So the beauty of the number value function as well is there's, um, if, say, for instance, I had spaces in here, okay, and then went to come to autofill that one down, you see it converts the spaces to the commas as well. So I think you'll find it's quite a handy function. So apologies for that, the number value function, fantastic function that you can use. Uh, and then as you get import your data from wherever you're importing it and it comes as those horrible European figures, then you can use the number value to function to change them to manageable number numerical figures you can put as text and put as text, put as um, currency and accountancy, etc. Thank you so much for watching.